This video is going to show you how to configure out this play unit by push buttons, including PV cleaning, factory reset, and other basic functions. PV cleaning, press Z and S buttons uh, for 5 seconds. When it shows PV equals zero, the operation succeeded. And a factory reset, we press S button for five seconds. When it shows restore, the operation succeeded. So next, I'm going to introduce the basic functions of our display unit. We press M enter the menu. This is to set the display mode. We have the PV display mode, and we press Z to select. We press S to modify. This is a PV mode, and this is, press S. This is a minute mode. This is percent mode. Okay, here we choose the PV mode, and then we press M confirm. This is to set the unit. We have a lot of unit inside. You can. Choose whatever you want. We press Z to select, and then press S modify kilo Pascal, and press S mega Pascal, bar pizza, etc. Here we uh, go back to kilo Pascal. Okay, so press M confirm. This is to set the low range value, so you can. Set whatever you want. Let's say it's 100. So I press Z to select the numbers I want to change. So firstly, we have to change the decimal locations. Okay, it's a flash, and I'm gonna press S to change the locations. Okay, we change it back to here, and then we press Z to select the numbers we want to change. We want to change it 20. Okay, press two, and I press Z. We are here zero. And we press M confirm. This is to set the uprange value. Let's set it to 500. We press Z to select the numbers we want to change. Okay, press S to modify 500. We press M to confirm. This is to set the damping time. Let's set to uh, five seconds. I press Z, and we change this to zero. Okay, we press the again back to here. We change it to five. Okay, we press M confirm. This is to set the output uh, features. We have linear and a square root. So we press this select and press S to modify. So linear and press S square root. Okay, we back to linear and press M confirm. This is to set alarm. We have three patterns, no alarm, high alarm, and the low alarm. Let's press Z, select, and press S to change. Okay, we set high alarm, press M. This is to set the pole address. So you can set whatever you want. Uh, here we can set to five, and press Z. One, two, three, four, five. And then we press F, M, confirm. This is to set SV display mode. This function is able to uh, make you can say uh, your media temperature on the display. So let's have set it. We press Z and I press S to modify. We can choose Celsius, press S, Fahrenheit, Kelvin, and also this is Fahrenheit. So here we choose Fahrenheit. Let's took Take a look at what it look like. <clears throat> Press M to out. So you can see the display, alternated display the media temperature and your current pressure value. Okay, we're back to the menu. As we display mode. So as we, so we change it to off. Press Z and press S modify. Off, okay. We press M confirm. This is the dot numbers. Uh, this is two, we change it to three. 
let's take a look like what is look like press m left okay one two three uh, okay let's back to the menu and we change it to two okay so let's have a look at what it look like press them okay so only two decimal okay let's back to the menu this is a fixed fixed current so we can press Z to select press 3.8 we have 4 8 12 16 20 20.8 this is help you to uh, check if our transmit output is same same as your ammeters. It will give the fixed output, I mean the uh, minimum output to the amps to help you to check if they are the same. Okay, we press M to back to the main display. Okay, the above is the basic functions of our LCD display. Thank you for watching.